Hi, I'm Rhys Giles. I'm the Learning Technologies Manager for Dixon's Car Phone in the UK and Ireland. I've been in the e-learning team at Car Phone Warehouse for around about four years and every year we'll always go out and we'll ask the same questions. You know, what do you need to do? What, how do we need to improve? You know, how can we get better? From people on the shop floor, from our stakeholders as well. And every time it's always said it needs to be a lot quicker, a lot sharper, a lot more relevant. So the, the Samsung um, S6 launched back in, I think it was March, something like that. There's about 15, 16 pieces of content on there, which ranges from the actual reviews I just mentioned all the way through to something that our own brand department did on the best accessories for the S6. Uh, and it's really quite powerful, you know, the comments that we've already had back, you know, people are commenting and chatting and sharing their own tips on the S6, and it's really quite a powerful story. Um, and the best thing for me as a learning technologies manager was it took me 15 minutes to create it. That's pretty good. <laughs> One of the things that I suppose all departments um, or all in departments have um, had over the last couple of years is that we've always been challenged by the business to do more for less. That's what I suppose um, really captured my imagination about micro learning is that we can just create something that fits the business need at the time that it needs it. Um, we can still do assessments, we can still see whether there's any return on investment. You don't lose that by micro learning, but what you actually gain from it is the ability for people to go back and reconsume that content, but just the piece that they actually need to, rather than the whole 45 minutes or half an hour's worth of content. But the fact that we can, we can now create this content really quickly, it means we can align properly with the, the needs of the business. We can now start to support things on a weekly basis as well. Um, for me, that's really powerful. It's something we've never had the chance to do before because we've needed too much lead time up, up to, um, to creating this. So we still have great pull content on the platform. And I know look as push as a hook. So, you know, if we're making people go onto the platform in the first place to do, it might be a test or it could be, a, you know, just a piece of learning. It gives them the opportunity to have a look around the site, to see all the really cool stuff that's on there. And we're finding a lot of people now are diverging from just taking the test, which they would on the old LMS. They would just do that one piece. But now they're taking that test and then they're moving on and they're doing five, six, seven pieces of, of content, you know, videos or, you know, small PDFs or whatnot. What we've seen is, um, is that training hours have gone up. You know, for example, one piece of content, the launch video for our new network ID, um, in just a month has been watched 25,000 times. You know, which is phenomenal considering only doing that for 7,500 people. Well, I see the future as user-generated content. For me, that's such a, a key thing. So we replaced our existing LMS with Fuse. We've got great feedback from that. And I now think we're in a position where we can start to look at the mobile app, putting that in the hands of everybody in retail. And then the moment that you do that, it really allows us to get knowledge experts across the entire business up and running and sharing um, their knowledge. I think the mobile app is going to revolutionise the way that we do things. So I think um, we couldn't do what we're looking to do in terms of a strategy without Fuse. What I, what I really like about the platform is the fact that it takes everything that we've looked at in our research, YouTube, you know, Reddit, um, GitHub, Twitter, all of these social media platforms, it's taken the social media elements out of it and applied it to a knowledge management platform um, which supports learning Google you know it supports people on the shop floor um, and it just I think it allows people to know what they need to know at that moment rather than just in case